Hello and welcome to Tricks and Treats, a short little Halloween RPG maker game, I believe, uh, de developed by RK Kid and available on itch.io. You know, it's just a short little game that uh, is made by the same developer as Cemetery Mary, I believe, just a little visual novel I did pretty recently. And well, you know, I just happened to notice that they made another game, you know, so I just you know, I want to check it out. And this one's a lot shorter, so... Let's see. Spirit, spirits, lend me your ears. On this night of Hollow's Eve, you'll find that I, I beg of thee, the barrier between our worlds is thin, so I call on you and all of your kin to pay us a visit in the land of the alive. And let your soul and body be revived. So accept your invitation. Come out and play. You'll just have to go back to the very next. Apparently summoning demons. You know, you gotta be a very good poet. You know, you gotta, gotta dish out those rhymes. Nekotary. Nekotary, are you still in your room? Your friends are coming soon. You're, you're not still in your pajamas, are you? Wait, really? Already? <laughs> okay. Hey, is that the uh, Reginald on the right? This is someone else, I don't know. I, uh, wow, I really lost track of time. I'll be down in a second. And I believe, you know, this game definitely is like its own thing. You know, it has nothing to do, well, maybe not nothing to do, but has very little to do with the uh, previous game that Arcade Kitten has done. I don't know, I just want to check it out. You know, it's, it's pretty quick and short. And, uh, while I do have some gripes about Cemetery Mary, I guess, not really gripes, but you know, some criticisms about it. I do like the art, so, you know, I, I just want to see if if it's any uh, any good, you know, do anything interesting with a lot, a lot uh, smaller of a story, you know, but anyway. Every aspiring necro necromancer needs one. Okay, apparently she's a necromancer of a child-friendly necronomicon. Do they just sell, do they just give these out now to anyone? Really? Well, my Halloween costumes are in the closet. It's your best friend, Reg Blush. Okay, I assume that's based on Reginald. I'm going out to be trick-or-treating and stuff, so I won't be home for a while, but you're okay with that, right? I'll be home before you know it. I'm not okay with that. <laughs> you know, as Reginald just becomes a real person and starts just stabbing everyone. Um, I'll clean this all up when I get home. Or tomorrow. Or the day after that. I'll clean them. Oh, I already said that. Skip, 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 go, go. Anything else? Can I interact with this bed? My bed. I don't use it right now. Look at this. Just some pictures. You always gotta do this in every RPG Maker game. Just look at mundane objects <laughs> just, just to see some flavor text. Obviously. Well, I ran out of time to get a new costume, so I'm gonna have to reuse an old costume this year. Which one should I go with? Okay, it's a choice. Wow. Branching paths. Witch, devil, or zombie? Uh, let's be a witch. Can't go wrong with the classics. Can I switch, actually? Actually, I want to switch. I want to see all the costumes. Little devil costume, okay. I'm happy about that. I'm not worried about it. It might not. And let's see the zombie costume. <laughs> zombie. Mom always said this would be such a cute costume with all that blood and stuff. But the blood is precisely the reason why I like it. You know, that's the whole point of the zombie costume, I guess. Let's be a witch. Yeah, I like the witch. Why not? Just, you just be a witch. I mean, it makes sense. Well, we're a necromancer, right? You should be, you should be dressing up as a witch. Unless you're a lich, you know? Unless you're already undead and put your soul into like a phylactery. Or phylactery? Phylactery? Phylactery. Nothing I need from here. Nothing I need from here. Nothing I need from here. Blah, 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 blah. Just some pictures. You go in here. Mom's room. I don't need to go there right now. All right. Do, 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 do. We're just going trick or treating. You know, I don't really do a lot of trick or treating, you know, as I got older. Definitely when I lived in a apartment building, you know, actually. Well, actually, that reminds me of a time I got stuck in an elevator and it was quite a traumatic experience, and now I don't like elevators, but anyway. <laughs> but, you know, the only time I went trick or treating was when I lived in the, in the apartment building. Ironically. Now that I don't, I don't really anymore. I don't really trick or treat at all. I don't see the point. Well, I don't really like candy as a thing. You know, I don't really have a sweet tooth. I used to have a, you know, maybe when I was a kid. I mean, a lot of kids just like sweet things, I guess. But 
But as I got older, I just don't really like candy, really. So, there's no point. Hold it. Objection. Like that. Uh, are you really gonna leave without saying goodbye? Is that mother? Sorry, Mama. I'm just really excited. You're wearing that costume. I'm surprised. I didn't know you liked it that much. Well, I wanted to be a vampire. Oh, honey, you know I tried looking. They just didn't have anything left in your size. It's fine. Maybe next year. Can I go now? I mean, you did say they were waiting for me, right? Oh, I still don't know about this. Why does our mother have hearts in her eyes, you know? Are you sure you don't want me to come along? I won't even follow you up to the house or anything. I'll just wait on the sidewalk. Mama, that's what you do every year. I know, I know. I'm just worried about you kids. Are you really gonna be alright on your own? Come on, Ma, we're old enough to go trick-or-treating by ourselves now. Totally not get killed. Is this a horror game, by the way? Do we die? I don't know. I actually have no idea. This game came out very recently. I just kind of, like, downloaded it and didn't really <laughs> check much else about this game. I have no idea if there's any spooky parts. I mean, there's there was no content warning or anything, so maybe not. Oh, yeah. Besides, there's three of us and all the other kids on the street, too. We're all looking out for each other. We'll be fine. Maybe it's just a, you know, it's probably just a nice, wholesome story. I have no idea, though, but... Um, Let's not, like, have uh, the wrong expectations. I don't think this is a spooky game or anything. Oh, all right. And you've got your flashlight and your phone in case you need to call me. Yes, Ma. All right, then. Oh, your friends are still coming over for dinner and movies after, right? But no, stay out too late. I'll order the food as soon as you get back. Yes, Ma. See you later. Be safe out there. Yeah, you made it. Sorry if I took too long. Ma was talking to me. No, uh, not a problem. Okay, Frankenstein. Your costume looks nice. Yeah, you look really cool, Neko Terry. Okay, you're a uh, astronaut. Okay. Embry. What? You're supposed to dress as something spooky on Halloween. Yeah, that's what I was gonna say. Actually, astronaut. Unless you're like a dead astronaut. You know, came back from space for revenge or something. But I like astronauts. Oh come on, it's Halloween. Can't we just get a trick-or-treating? Or can't get to trick-or-treating already? Yeah, you're right. What are we waiting for then? Let's go. Yeah. Woohoo! Rio and Embry are walking with you now. Wait. Can I uh, make the text faster, by the way? No. Uh, does it look like it? The text is a little bit too slow for me, but that's fine. Whatever. Okay, let's go a little RPG trick-or-treating adventure. Kind of reminds me of, uh, what's it called? Costume Quest? I don't know if there's gonna be any RPG battles, you know, but kinda reminds me of that game. Or it's just, you know, nothing too spooky. It's literally just a game about trick-or-treating, that's it. Wahoo! I love Halloween! Okay. I also like to run around in circles on Halloween. That's the tradition, right? Can I talk to the witch, by the way? Okay, get out of the way. I knew I shouldn't have let my brother eat so much candy. I'll never catch him. Okay, that's what you're trying to do? Alright. Hello? Werewolf? There's supposed to be a full moon out tonight, you know. But it's too cloudy to see it. Do you think it would be still be okay if I howled? I don't know. It would be a little strange. My sister said these costumes would be fun. I don't get it. Okay, three sisters, the same costumes. Nobody expects the Spanish Inquisition! <laughs> it's funny, right? It's the meme. You can laugh, you know, it's the meme! It's the meme, guys. Man, I'm hungry. Is it okay if I start eating my candy now? That totally isn't worth my sour gummies. Will you take these mints instead? No way, that definitely isn't worth my chocolate. What about these lollipops? I told my mom I didn't need a jacket. Now that I'm outside, I kind of regret it. I don't want to hide my costume, but... I'm chilled to the bone out here. Uh, get it? Anyway. Let's uh, trick or treat, I guess? Hi. Knock knock. Trick or treat. Trick or treat indeed. Have a happy Halloween, kiddos. Don't mind the fact that I'm just a shadow, by the way. I'm just a shadow person with no distinguishable features, you see. Three, one for each of you. Have a nice day. Have some poison chocolates with razors inside. I don't know. I've always heard that, by the way. You know, it's like scary people putting razors and needles in your candy or whatever. That would require a lot of work, I feel like. How would you do that? I don't know. 
Trick or treat. Oh, how cute. What are you supposed to be? Your worst nightmare. Ah, I see. Have fun out there. Oh, did we get candy? Where's my candy? I got two, I guess. Also have a cell phone, flashlight, and a ghost detector. Hmm. Do we need that? No. Are we going to detect ghosts? Treat. Sorry, kids. All out candy. Just kidding. Happy Halloween. It's, it's Halloween, buddy, not April Fool's. Anyway. Here's another werewolf. Hi. Do you know where spirits get their groceries from? The gro the grocery store. Ah. I didn't know this game was had so much puns in it. So, you guys getting good so far? Uh, let me see. Oh sweet, I got a full-size candy bar. Wait, really? Let me see if I got one. Dang, no luck. You should definitely give me yours. What? No way. Wait, it was worth a shot. What about you, bro? You get anything good? If you got any full-size candy bars, you should totally, totally give them to me. Uh, hello? Rio? Oh, sorry. I was looking at that girl over there. What girl? Over there? At the top? Okay. Who are you? That girl in front of the house. She looks kind of sad, right? Do you think she's okay? I don't know. But there's only one way to know for sure, right? Hey! Huh? Oh, sorry. I'm not you wearing anything, am I? What? No. We saw you all by yourself over here. Is everything okay? Oh. Yeah, I'm fine. I just, uh... I don't have anyone to go trick-or-treating with this year. Oh? See, I thought I convinced some of my friends to come with me this year. But no one showed up. Hehe. <laughs> totally not awkward at all. Really? I'm sorry. It's not so bad. I mean, I'm still getting candy, right? It's totally bad. Huh? Necrotary. <laughs> no tact at all. Halloween's only fun when you have friends to spend it with. You come trick-or-treating with us. Hey, really? Awesome. Why she looks so evil? Because of the shadow? Uh, with the shadow on her face? Yeah, dude, the more the merrier. It's nice to meet you, uh... Sorry, what's your name? I'm Sunny. I'm Embry. Ryo. This is a Japanese name, by the way. Ryo. Everyone has, like, weird names, like Necrotary, Embry. I don't know if that's, like, a language that I know that it's based on. It seems made up. And Sunny. I guess Sunny is a normal name. But, like, just randomly Ryo. I mean, he's, I guess maybe he's just Japanese. I don't know. Anyway. Welcome to the group. Come on, let's go. This Necrotary, you know, Necrotary doesn't seem like some, like, a real name to me. I don't know, anyway. Because I just assume everyone's name is just made up. But, you know, actually, I don't know, for the most part, pretty normal, I guess. At least Sunny and Real are just normal names. Um, I'm not sure about Embry, though. Is that a normal name? It reminds me of Embryo, but that's not right. It's a shame Halloween only comes once a year. I could celebrate Halloween every day. Give me your candy. Trick or treat. Happy Halloween, cans. Remember not to eat it all one night. No promises. I'm gonna give myself a stomach ache. Well, I guess I can't stop you. Can't knock again? Can't, you can't, like, do it twice? It's cheating. Boo! Did I scare ya? Uh, sure. Ah, I knew it! Here's treat. Hey kids, take one candy each, please. So oh, Sunny, are you from around here? I've never seen you in the neighborhood before. Or at school. Oh, uh, kinda, I guess. I don't go to school, though. What? Well, lucky. Yeah, what? I wanna not go to school, too. <laughs> well. Haha. <laughs> well, it's not, not all that it's cracked up to be, at least from what I've heard. I mean, I guess the disadvantage of being homeschooled is that you don't get to meet any peers, which could be a good or a bad thing, actually. You know, actually, when I think about it, maybe I should, I would've been. I would have wanted to be homeschooled. Because as it turns out, the people... You know, for me anyway, the worst thing about school was definitely the people. Anyway, will you go to the store tomorrow? Why? Because all the candy will be half off. My candy cow will be double. That's true. I guess, you know, a lot of stores, they stock up on candy. And then when there's left over, you know, there's gotta be a big sale to get rid of it. Even though it's a bit, a bit cliche, I wanted to be a witch this Halloween. I guess everyone else had the same idea. Mm, 
I also want to be witch. Trick or treat! Oh, such spooky costumes. Sunny, sunny. Yeah? After we're done trick or treating, we're gonna watch movies at my house. You wanna come too? Oh, really? I'd love to. But uh, actually, I have to check in with my stepdad first. Stepdad? Yeah, I'm kind of like adopted in a way. No way, I'm adopted too. Really? Oh, really? That makes us like adopted sisters, does it? Is that how it works? I don't think that's how that works. No idea. My friends took a bathroom break, so I'm waiting for them to come back out. Uh, can't they hurry up? They should... Well, ma maybe they're pooping, you know? They're doing the number two. If they're gonna take that long. Or maybe they're doing something else, I don't know, anyway. Hello? That's super dumb. You should ring the doorbell. I'm not doing it because, uh, I don't want to step on the grass. Yeah? That's a stupid reason. You should go up the house. I can't do it because, uh, I'm allergic to their doorbell. Okay. I don't know. Are they shy? Let's go up, though. Just press the arrow key. Press up on your keyboard. Retreat. Happy Halloween. Hey, Sonny, can I ask you something? Yeah? Oh, well. Why did your friend show up? Because you see, I killed them all. I mean, what? Uh, maybe we shouldn't... I don't know. Huh? I mean, like, everyone loves for the treating, right? At least, that's what I thought. But when I asked, none of them really seemed that interested. Dad said they probably changed their mind come Halloween, but... I guess not. That's lame of them. It's super lame. But I guess it's not so bad now that I met you guys. Hmm... I wonder if there's anything deeper. You know, I don't know. Is it, like, is it just a wholesome story about getting along with a new friend? Or is there something sinister going on anyway? I don't want Halloween to be over tomorrow. Can't Halloween cover two days? Or three? Or four? Or forever? Hey, Sunny. What are some of the things you like? Oh, uh, I really like candy. And stuffed animals. Play pretend. And adventures. Adventures? That's perfect. Because we're going on an adventure tonight! Wait, really? Where are we going? Where are we going? It's not where you need to ask, but why? Why? Nekoteru says she has something special planned for Halloween night. Uh-huh. Can you tell us now, since we're on the way there? No. If I tell you we're looking for ghosts now, it'll ruin the surprise. I mean... We're looking for ghosts? Ah, shit. <laughs> Wait, really? Yep, yep. I perform a seance back at home, right before you guys pick me up. And if it worked like it should, then we should have no problem running into real ghosts tonight. Are you really sure that'll work? I mean, I hope so. But it probably will. I mean, I've been practicing for a while, so... Right. What's the matter? You're not a scary pants like Embry, are you? Hey. Uh, no way. I just wonder if it'll really work, you know. Well, there's no better time to find out than on Halloween night, right? That's right. Somehow, you know, apparently all spirits of the dead they just pick that one holiday to show up, I guess. But we're almost there. Get ready to have your mind blown. Now, what is the origin of Halloween, by the way? I actually have no idea. I, I don't know. You know. I don't know why we have Halloween in the first place, actually. Uh, just a tradition, I guess. I don't know uh, the reason, you know, the, the first actual reason. Because I wonder, because I know like Valentine's Day, for example, is a completely commercial day. You know, it's just something that's just, well, no, I don't know. I, don't, I can't remember his origin. Maybe there was like a, I believe Val Valentine's, for example, is like a person's name, actually. But then it became like a more like commercialized holiday. You know, maybe something similar happened to Halloween. But anyway, I guess a lot of holidays are like that. You brought us to the graveyard. Well, it's pretty spooky. Yes, I did. Are we gonna are we gonna meet Mary? Maybe. If my ritual back at home worked, then there's bound to be ghosts here somewhere. I mean, where else would they be? And now that it's the witching hour on Halloween, the chances of us meeting one are higher than ever. The witching hour. It's only eight o'clock. Yeah, I know. But Mom doesn't want us staying out too late, and this was the best I could do. Okay, but still, I'll be fine. Do you really think we're going to find something? Well, there's only one way to find out, right? And it'll be easy, too, with my handy-dandy ghost detector. Hey, I remember when you bought that. Did you call it a stupid hunk of plastic after you tried it, though? Yeah, but that wasn't on Halloween. 
Come on, I'm sure we'll find something. Search for ghost activity in the cemetery. Is there a game like that? That got pretty popular recently? Phasmagora or something? Phasmagoria? Phasmatobia? I don't know. Phasmophobia. Anyway. What's this? Maxwell Marquise Johnson. Satisfaction has no solid definition, but for you, it is unreachable. What does that mean? I don't know. But maybe Maxwell himself will, will want to tell us? Mm, I'm not hearing anyone. Me neither. Guess he doesn't have much to say. Well, that's okay. Eh, there's still lots of other people here. One of them's gotta want to talk to us. Come on, one of them. Very spooky, but... <laughs> uh, can I use an item? Use candy? No? Okay. We're just gonna walk around, I guess. Until we see something. Do, do, do. Oh, this is a dead end, alright. Go this way instead. Cemeteries. You know, you always see it in a lot of uh, Japanese media, by the way. Especially, obviously, anime, you know, and visual novels. Cemeteries definitely is spookier in Japanese culture. Because most people don't aren't, like, buried into the ground, you know, in Japan. Most of them are uh, cremated, I believe, instead. So the fact that because it's more rare, you know, to have cemeteries in Japan, it's considered more spooky. Because it's just not a thing, you know, in Japan. Anyway, Jackson L. Tombs, just like a random fact. A life is given to, to take away. A lesson learned, but perhaps forgotten. A lesson learned? I wonder what lesson that is. But maybe he'll be willing to teach it to us. Huh? I wonder if I have to remember these names. I have no idea. I don't think anyone's here. Maybe the next one? Yeah, maybe. Okay. But yeah, that's why, I don't know, that's why, you know, if, I mean, this is not a Japanese game or anything, but I'm just reminded of that. Whenever I think about cemeteries, it's kind of like, it's always a lot spookier to, uh, like, uh, like in an anime or whatever, because, you know, it's just meant to be very scary. It's still pretty scary, I guess, even if you're not Japanese, but, I don't know. I imagine it's even more scary if you never really think about it. it, it when you do think about it, it's it really kind of creepy, isn't it? You just put a bunch of, like, corpses in the ground, you know, and that's normal. Hmm. As, uh, what does that say? Bastardus, maybe? B-A? Bastardus in death as he was in life. What's this word? It looks like someone tried to smudge it out, but I think it's a... Uh, it's the B word. What? You can't put that on the headstone. Well, I guess anything is possible. But does he want to talk to us? Well, let's see. I guess not. But I haven't given a hope, uh, hope yet. Alright. Well, two ways to go. Go over here. Oh, nothing here. Alright. I guess we'll go over here. And we can run. Wee. I wonder if we need to run from ghosts later, I don't know. Sibyl Valentine. May those who had the misfortune of knowing her love rejoice at her passing. Yorokobe. Jeez, why are so many of these headstones so grim? Eh, grim. Like the Grim Reaper. I mean, yes, the Grim Reaper is grim. That's why they're called... Never mind. <laughs> Miss Sybil, are you there? I guess she's not in the mood to talk. I guess we'll move on. Now this one. Sunny day. Hmm, wait a minute. The brightest daughter we could have ever hoped for. Hey, this girl has your name. Oh, uh, really? That, that's, uh, spooky. Haha, <laughs> I'm, to I'm totally not the same person. Sunny, though. Wait a minute. Sunny was in, uh, in Cemetery Mary, wasn't she? I think she's a character in Cemetery Mary, by the way. Ah, maybe our Sonny's a ghost too. Ha 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 ha. No way. Well, it looks like no one's responding to this. On to the next one. Ha. <laughs> totally not. The ghost right in front of us right now. Asius Kobayashi. Danced his heart out. Literally, he danced so hard that his heart popped out, and that's how he died. Wow, I didn't know you could do that. I don't think it means literally. But what if he really did dance too hard? Maybe he wants to show us what kind of dance he did? Or maybe not. Oh. 
And move on. Over here. Or over here. The grass is very purple, by the way. There's something about this grave. But there's still other graves that need to be checked out first. Okay. Well, this means special, but there's more to check out. Oh, there's one over here. Calvin Baker. All dressed up and no place to go. All dressed up. Well, I'd love to see what he's wearing. Well, it's probably just a suit. You're just saying that because you don't want to see a ghost. You're too scared. I'm not. I just would prefer if there weren't any ghosts. Really? But isn't it kind of exciting? Talking to someone from a totally different world? I think that's really fun. Exactly. Now, if only one of them would actually come talk to us. You might get your wish. Anyway. I guess let's go back over here. Whoop. Lumina. Not gone, not dead, just lighting the way for others someplace new. Not gone and not dead. But if she isn't either of those things, is she even going to speak to us? I guess not. I don't get it. I keep getting signs on the detector, but nothing happens. Hey, uh, Necrotary, can we go home? Huh? Well, it's getting kind of late, and we're kind of starting to get hungry. It's also getting colder. Right. I wanted to get a bit more candy before the night was over anyways. Let's go. Okay. Let's go home. Do, 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 do. Who's there? <laughs> uh -huh, very funny, Neko Cherry. I told you I'm not a scaredy cat. Um, that wasn't me. Who's there? <laughs> this is like very cliche ghost font. That voice is coming from behind us. Yeah. Is that ghost? A real ghost? Who's there? Uh, run! What do you mean? I thought this was what you were waiting for. Not a ghost like that. Come on, let's get out of here. Press shift to run. Yeah. Wait, let me just save. Hey, what happens if I die? Ah, I'm dead. Yeah. No, 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 I can't die. I told my mom I got home safe. There has to be something I can do. Well, wait, my flashlight. Maybe he'll scare it away. Be gone, ghost. Be gone, ghost. Huh? Oh, it's Mary. You guys seem shaken. Uh, that's because we are. Oh, why? Uh, because you were chasing us through a dark cemetery at night? That's why. Oh, right. Sorry. Wait, no, I'm the one who should be getting mad at you. What are you kids doing out here all by yourselves? Okay. Mary's wearing a dress. It's a little torn, though. I don't know why. What's going on with her? She's wearing like a wedding dress, it seems. Especially all the way out here. The guys could have gotten hurt. And, uh, that just wouldn't be good, you know? Sorry. Yeah, we didn't mean to cause you any trouble. What are you doing out here anyways? I had this ghost detector, you see, and I've been reading up on ghosts in the dead for a long time. And I thought that maybe since it's Halloween, well, maybe, maybe, something would happen. But I guess not. This stupid thing was just a dumb hunk of plastic after all. Uh, ma'am, if I could ask, what are you doing here? Me? I'm out here every Halloween. Really? Why's that? Because nasty teenagers are always trying to sneak in here on Halloween. They come in here with their store about U <laughs> Luigi boards, no, Ouija boards, and soda cans. They sit in the graves and leave their trash laying all about. They don't have any respect for this place and what it stands for. Ah, it just makes me so... Ah, I'm sorry. I don't know what came over me just then. I just... This place is very special to me. I don't like seeing people making it dirty. So I guard this place on Halloween and scare them off. But you guys weren't trying to mess anything up. You're just kids having fun. Sorry if I scared you too much. Uh, it's okay. Speak for yourself. So we're not in trouble? Uh, no. At least not with me. I don't know how your parents would feel if they found out. I guess that's our sign to head home, then. Well, hold on a moment. I had a feeling I might run into some kids somewhere tonight, so I bought a, brought a bit of candy with me just in case. Help yourself. Well, no ghosts, but at least we got candy out of it. I'll take candy over ghosts any day. Thank you, miss. Some candy for you, some candy for you. Huh? 
Uh, are you okay? Yeah, I'm totally fine. I'm like super chipper. <laughs> yeah, thank you for the candy, Mayor, uh, miss. Yeah, of course, no problem. Weird. I mean, you know, it's, yeah, it's the same Sunny. Also, Mary seems older. Is this like, you know, I guess this is like a little bit after the events of the original visual novel. But anyway, all right, well, you guys get home safe, okay? Don't let any spooky spirits catch you on your way out. Yes, ma'am. Man, I've never been happier to go home on Halloween. Thanks for not killing us, old guardian of the cemetery. Happy Halloween. Okay. Well, turns out, yeah, it was no, no spooky ghosts. Just, it was just Mary. Hanging out in the cemetery, as usual. But that girl, she seemed familiar. But no, I, I don't know her from anywhere. Do I? So there you go. I wonder what happens if you don't get caught. I don't know, is there a way to, like, escape without getting caught? I mean, actually, you know, I think the actually revealing Mary is kind of like a cool thing, you know? I don't know if there's a way to avoid that. Anyway, well, so much for that. I'm sorry, you guys. I really wanted to make this Halloween fun for everyone. But I guess I just messed it all up. Sorry for dragging you all the way out here and just wasting everyone's time. What are you talking about? I had loads of fun. Really? Yeah, I did too. Not even they just called me a scary cat all night. Yeah, this was awesome. I never had so much fun on Halloween before. Thanks for bringing me on such an exciting adventure. Wait, you guys are all happy? But we didn't even find any ghosts. Who cares about that? We just like having a fun time with you. It's true. It's just like you said earlier, Necrotary. Halloween's the most fun when you're sharing it with your friends. Yeah, you're right. Thanks, guys. There you go. Oh, looks like everyone's already started to head home for the night. But that's okay. Mama's waiting at home for us. And she might get worried if we stay out too much longer. Let's go. Alright. Let me just save it here real quick. I want to check real quick. Does it matter? What happens if we, uh, escape? Because I, I want to check if we kept the same scene, or maybe there's something different, you know, that happens if we escape. Huh? The gate won't open. What do you mean? Isn't that how we came in? What are we supposed to do then? We might have to face this ghost head on. Ah, oh, okay. So, okay, there really is no way to escape. It's just like, you have to face it. All right. So now that I know, I can just go back there. Oh yeah, you are meant to be hot. Which is a little bit, you know, when I play RU, any kind of RPG maker horror game, uh, you usually escape, right, without getting caught. That's usually the uh, mechanic of any kind of chase sequence, but actually, you are supposed to get caught there. Anyway. I was trying to do the wrong thing, but actually, like the first time when I uh, we saw the monster, I was trying to do the wrong thing, but actually it was the right thing. Anyway. Let's continue on. Let's go home. Let's watch some movies. What movies are going to watch? Hmm? I assume horror movies. Where's, oh, where's Sunny? Where did Sunny go? Sunny? Hello? Hmm. That's weird. Where'd she go? Did she get lost? Where is she? Sunny? Hello? Well, she disappeared though. She vanished. I assume that's intentional, but I don't know where she went. Knock, knock. Oh, there you are. I was just about to call you. Well, did you guys have fun? Yeah, we had a lot of fun. Uh, I forgot to call earlier and ask, but can I invite another friend to have dinner with us? Uh, sure, honey. Who is it? Her name's Sunny, and she's right. Huh? Hey, where's Sunny go? Oh, I get it. You're playing uh, some sort of prank on me, right? Very funny. Come on in, everyone. I'll call for dinner. And I'll be sure to save a seat for Sunny, too. Uh, guys, what happened to Sunny? Uh, didn't you hear her earlier? Uh, no. Well, she told me that she saw her dad waiting to pick her up. And she didn't want to keep him waiting, so she left. Oh, I see. Uh, that stinks. I wish you could have at least stayed and had dinner with us. Hey, it's not so bad. Yeah, you still have us. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> yeah, I guess. But still. What are you kids doing out there? Hurry on inside before you let the bugs in. Uh, yes, Mama. 
Hmm. I never understood this movie. Why not? What's not to get? I mean, Elaine just met the Great Witch, but she isn't a witch herself, right? So why does she get to ride on the broomstick? I, oh, I always figured you didn't need to be a witch to ride on the broom. Like anyone can hop on, it's just that witches are the only ones who own them. Yeah, that's what I thought too. This is really fun, but it's sad that Sunny isn't here with us. Did I really just not hear her say goodbye? Oh well. It's food here. I'll be there in a sec. Secretary, where are you? I'm in my room. Yum yum yum, eating candy. Ryo's dad already picked up Ryo and Embry. Oh, all right. Uh, don't stay up too late, okay? And don't eat all that candy one night. As she eats all that candy one night. Okay. There's a note mixed in with, with my Halloween candy. The name on it says it's from... It's from uh, Sunny. Hi, Nekoteri. It's me, Sunny. I wanted to say sorry for running out without saying goodbye. I just didn't know how to say goodbye without ruining the fun. Plus, my stepdad was waiting for me. How did you, like, write all of this, you know, before we, before you left? Just somehow wrote it really fast. And he has a bit of a tight schedule, so I couldn't keep him waiting long. I'm sorry I couldn't stay to watch movies and stuff. I really wanted to, but my home is actually real far away. But my stepdad was nice enough to let me come all the way here for Halloween. So I hope you understand why I had to leave so soon. But I had a really good time. The best time, actually. And if you still be if you still be watching how movies next Halloween, maybe I can visit my stepdad let's stay a little longer. Hoping to see you next year, Sunny. Wait, I already said this was from Sunny at the top of the letter. Uh, oops. I see. I hope I can see you next Halloween then, Sunny. So, did you have fun? Fun? Okay, stepdad. I assume the stepdad is the Grim Reaper. <laughs> I had a blast. I had so much fun. I'm glad to hear it. Can we come back next year? Please? Pretty please? Of course we can. Maybe next year Mallory and the others will come too. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I bet they'll want to come next year, especially once they see all the candy I got. Oh, speaking of... I saved this one for you. Oh, for me. That's sweet, dear, but you didn't have to do that. But I wanted to. Besides, I know chocolate's your favorite. Oh. Okay, oh, that's the unicorn guy. Which, by the way, this is... Never really explained, but... Ah, whatever. I'm not gonna go on a weird rant about how, like... There's just a lot of unexplained mechanics in the Cemetery Mare universe. Uh, let's not do that right now. Anyway, how, how did you know that? I know a lot of things. I suppose so. Thank you. I actually see them. I actually see the face, by the way. We don't really, I don't think we saw the weird unicorn man's face before. So I guess there's that. He's actually a bishonen. Anyway, thank you for letting me spend Halloween here. I can't remember the last time it was this fun. Oh, and you'll never guess who I saw today. And who's that? Well, okay, wait, hold on. There's a story with it. It all started when I met this white-haired girl trick-or-treating with her friends. And... Yeah. Alright, so there you go. Just a short little Halloween adventure with some characters and some references to Cemetery Mary, which is nice, I guess. Not, not super, you know tied in to the main story of the visual novel or anything, but, you know, just like its own little side story, I guess. It's interesting. So there you go. I mean, if you didn't get it, you know, Sunny is like a ghost girl. Because, uh, you know, just to explain the context, though, I guess, it's a small thing, but Sunny uh, was a character we saw before in, uh, in Cemetery Mary that is actually in the afterlife. No, she's just dead, you know, but apparently she got to go trick-or-treating because the Grim Reaper just lets, you know, the, he, he just lets dead people walk around on Halloween, I guess. It's a, it's a dramatic irony, you know, because Necrary wanted to meet a ghost. As it turns out, she did meet a ghost. She didn't know it. Anyway, there you go. It's mostly just a wholesome little, fun little story about Halloween. Tricks and treats. And I guess that'll be that for this game. I guess, uh, yeah. No, just a cute little game. If you're on YouTube, if you didn't know, I stream these games live on Twitch. So check me out over there if you're interested. And I also have other playthroughs on the channel, so look for those if you want. Thanks for watching. Until next time, see you then.